Good morning and welcome to Yoga for Life, although I'm videotaping from home today. It is Sunday, December the 13th, 2020. And I appreciate you joining me for our uh, weekly Sunday meditation. And uh, if you've been joining me recently, you know that we are uh, proceeding through the 10 steps of Yoga Nidra, the Yogi Sleepless Sleep. So while I explain today's um, itinerary for our meditation, I invite you to get set up in a supine position, preferably with a bolster beneath your knees and a roll towel or blanket under your neck for support. Or you can lay in your bed or on your sofa, uh, whatever is most comfortable for you as you lie down on your back. So this is our first, fourth week of uh, Yoga Nidra, uh, which is the Yogi Sleepless Sleep. And uh, I am taking these scripts from Practical Yoga Nidra, a 10-step method by Scott Moore. And um, I also uh, apologize that I forgot to gather uh, a poetry book, so there won't be any poetry this morning. Um, but. I'll make up for it next week with two points. Um, our Sanskrit focus is bhakti, which is your spiritual path of devotion uh, towards whatever uh, deity, divinity source you attune to. And our mudra is the ushas mudra. And so you can lay this mudra on your abdomen once you're in the supine position, but we interlace the fingers and rest the left thumb on top of the right, palms facing up. And the Ushas Mudra connects us to all things good. So I invite you to get comfortably seated and I'll take you progressively deeper into this meditative state um, as we attune to the breath in this fourth step of Yoga Nidra. So hopefully by this time you're comfortably uh, aligned and we will begin. Welcome to Yoga Nidra. Lie down and make yourself as comfortable as possible. Clear any excess energy by breathing in through the nose, holding your breath for just a second and letting it go with a sigh. Do this a few times and then breathe naturally. So let's do that together. Take a deep nostril inhale and sigh out the mouth. Repeat. And back to your classic Ujjayi breath. Now begin to notice your surroundings. Notice any thoughts and emotions you have at this moment. Practice welcoming recognizing and witnessing anything you're aware of in this moment, either internal or external. Repeat your samkhapa in your head a few times if you have one, and we establish that, remember, in our first step. If you don't have one, just develop one now. A samkhapa is your intent for the practice. and state that silently. Abandon any control of your breath now and simply notice what the breath is doing. Without changing your breath, feel as if you're breathing into your face. Now breathe into your entire head. Breathe into your arms, chest, and belly, back, pelvis, legs, feet. Breathe into only the front side of your body. Feel as if your entire front side gets bigger with each breath. Now breathe into only the back side of your body and feel as if your entire backside gets bigger with each breath. Front side, back side. 
Now breathe into your entire body. Your entire body is breathing. Notice how you feel energy in this moment. Where in your body do you feel energy? How you, would you describe this energy? Is it sharp or dull? Is it moving or still? Are there colors connected to the way the energy feels in your body? What are all the ways feeling energy in this movement and moment affects you? Simply invite, acknowledge, and observe any way that energy manifests in this moment. Now bring your attention to the floor of your pelvis and notice the energy there. This is your first chakra. Imagine a bright red glow. Picture your favorite spot on earth, a garden, a trail, or a beach. Now remember a time when you felt at home. Notice how your energy feels in this moment. Now bring your attention to your lower abdomen. This is your second chakra. Imagine a bright orange glow. Picture your favorite body of water and remember a time when you were able to go with the flow of any events in your life. Notice how your energy feels in this moment. Now bring your attention to your belly. This is your third chakra. Imagine a bright yellow glow and picture a time when you enjoyed feeling the sun on your skin. Now remember feeling powerful in your life. Notice how your energy feels in this moment. Bring your attention to your heart. This is your fourth chakra. Imagine a bright green glow. Remember your favorite green space, a forest, a field, or a garden. What is something you love without reservation? Notice how your energy feels in this moment. Place your attention on the center of your throat. This is your fifth chakra. Imagine a bright sky, blue glow. Picture looking up into the clouds, lost in the blue sky. Remember a time when you felt that you spoke your truth, trusting that you would be heard? Notice how you feel in this moment. Move your attention to the center of your forehead. This is your sixth chakra. Imagine an indigo glow, an iridescent blue-purple. Picture floating high in the atmosphere. Remember a time of deep inner knowing. Notice how your energy feels in this moment. Finally, move your attention to the crown of your head. This is your seventh chakra. Imagine a violet glow reaching toward the heavens. Picture yourself floating in space without an up or a down, a right or a left. And remember a time when you felt connected to all things. Notice how you feel in this moment. Bring your attention to the feeling of energy through your entire body. You may even feel energy outside your body. While energy is constantly changing, it reveals that which is that which is never changing. Your awareness with a capital A. Be the unchanging awareness. Experience your body in the floor by feeling your hands and your feet and your chest and your belly. When you hear me count down from five and ring the Tibetan bell, that will end the yoga nidra practice. Because you've practiced feeling the energy in your body, you'll be able to powerfully direct the flow of energy in your life to manifest 
where you need it. So continue in the feeling of the breath, the prana energy moving through the channels, the chakras, the whole body. Be at peace in this energy, this living energy, the breath. Five, four, three, two, one. Deepening your breath, sensing your groundedness, wiggling fingers and toes, and slowly, safely coming up into a comfortable seat for your body. Bring the hands into Anjali Mudra at the heart. Om Mani Padmi Hum. May all beings be happy and may all beings be free from suffering. We'll seal our morning's meditation with Ramadasa, the seed sound for healing energy. Beginning with a deep nostril inhale. Rama Dasa, Rama Dasa, Rama Dasa, Om. Rama Dasa, Rama Dasa, Rama Dasa, Om. Rama Dasa, Rama Dasa, Rama Dasa, Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. We are all just walking each other home, Ram Das. Until we meet again, be well, stay safe, and be kind. Namaste.